Eminem undoubtedly has had an incredibly successful as well as controversial music career and in this video I'm going to explain to you how such a massive figure in music has gone from one of the most beloved to someone who has thrashed around in the music industry on the daily. But before I do that, I had a picture of Eminem somewhere in this video, so if you find it, let me know in the comments below for a chance to get pinned. Without further ado, here's how Eminem's legacy was tainted. Marshall Bruce Mathers III? Marshall Bruce Mathers III who was born on October 17, 1972, in St. Joseph, Missouri, and then moved to Kansas, and then to Detroit, and then to Kansas, and then to Detroit, Michigan, and then to Kansas, and then to Detroit, and then stayed there, I think, started rapping in 1996 and grew an underground cult following. He was best known for his battle rapping at the time in Detroit, Michigan, which is, by the way, very close to where I live. But he was a quick-witted artist with a sense of humor, and he completely blew up with the song known as My Name Is, and would proceed to release many more songs as well, as well as the Slim Shady LP, which was released in 1999 that would get a lot of mainstream success and cement his name into the industry, as he continued to inspire millions. Eminem is incredibly influential. He's influenced a lot of artists you can hear it in everyday music, you know, like NF, I don't listen to him. Token, I don't listen to him. But like, you could definitely hear his impact in a lot of these newer generation artists, or even generations before that. Eminem's been around for a while, man. He's been around for like multiple decades. And along with that time that you're sitting there on top, there's definitely going to be a lot of people that have animosity with you. I don't know if I used that properly, but he had beef with people like Nick Cannon, I'm pretty sure, as well as his most famous, or I don't know what that, that term is there, the, his biggest argument he had with Machine Gun Kelly over, I believe, his daughter. Uh, MGK was doing something with his daughter or something like that, and they had beef. And Eminem didn't like that very much. So Eminem was like, how could you? Then Machine Gun Kelly made a diss track on Eminem. And then Eminem completely obliterated Machine Gun Kelly and completely made him switch genres. So, you know, it was, it was really baffling to watch. But all that happened. And it was a little bit corny. I'm not going to lie to you. The entire beef was a little bit corny. And I think that's when Eminem started to fall off was soon after that. Eminem was seen as corny now, whereas before he was seen as incredibly funny and all these things. But alongside his music, he was growing and aging incredibly fast. And it's a lot harder to keep up with the times. And it would be kind of weird if he had the exact same mentality that he did or acted the exact same way that he did 20 years ago. So naturally, Eminem changed. And most people don't like the new Eminem, the new music that Eminem's releasing, including myself. I think he tries too much. He tries too much, you know? It's, he does a very lyrical, schmirical, weirical, spherical type of music, you know? It's very corny, arguably. Some people like it, some people don't. But I think this is where we've had a lot of people not liking Eminem now, you know? Eminem's gotten in some silly beefs. Eminem in general is just a controversial figure now or even more controversial than before and we've been seeing a lot more uh hate than praise i still think that eminem deserves his flowers he was very important in the music industry but as time goes on we've seen more and more deteriorating of his image and regardless of this he's still gonna go down as one of the most influential but i can speak for a lot of you guys that eminem does not hit the same that he used to and I think it's possible for him to fix this. No, I don't. No, Eminem might be able to fix this, but I don't know how he would fix this. So I'm going to end the video at that. I'll let you decide. And let me know if you think that Eminem can take a step in the right turn in the comments below for a chance to get pinned. And yeah, if you enjoyed this video, 
let me know give me constructive criticism though i really need that more than anything i'm trying to trying to grow this youtube channel a lot and i don't know when i should add like when i should be joking around or when i shouldn't be because you know i'm trying to keep a, a similar tone and pace you know i need to get i need to get very incredible at that over time that's the goal here so subscribe if you want to join us on that ride if not that's straight to uh that's all i wanted to say though i love you all thank you for the support i'm conflicted and i'm out peace yeah.